One of the conversations that we've been having around the state and the county level with regard to OERs, the Open Education Resources, is the why. So why are we exploring this uh, so deeply at the county and state level? And I think it really starts with identifying your need. And this need is going to be different um, at every building, at every district. So our conversations at the county level start with identifying your need. So do you have any gaps in your current curriculum? Are you looking to start new courses where you may just have a pilot course for let's say 21st century learning or digital citizenship? Or you may be starting a, a course uh, like computer science and there's no available curriculum. So you can take a look at what's available that's openly licensed rather than having teachers create something from scratch. So the beauty of OERs is that they can be remixed, they can be reused, and their teachers are able to use them ethically and legally. Whereas when we send teachers to the internet and say, go find some resources, we're not always sure whether we have licenses to use that material. So the conversation at the county level is really around what's available, what can be reused, what can be remixed to identify your need, and what can be then ethically reused and redistributed and within the confines of the Creative Commons license.